Hello tubers, it's your crazy British bloke here. Well, it's Wednesday. I just had a phone call from Bobby. Where's Bobby? Uh, he said, am I bored? I said, yeah, nothing to do today. So I'm going to meet him down at Lambeth Fish and Tackle Shop. I think he's getting some new line put on the uh, on his reel. And then we're going to go down to the Tim, Tem, Tim's, the Thames. Well, actually, we are going to go to Tim's on the way. Then we're going to go to the Thames River um, down near Delaware. And uh, he said he, there's some, you know, maybe some good fish in there. So let's go see what we can get up to. Here we are. It's the old rod and tackle shop. Bobby here yet? No, Bobby's not here yet. Oh well, we'll have to park up and wait for him. This is where we've come to. Bobby to get some new line. Oh, it says it's closed. Oh, well, that's really good. <laughs> Oh dear. Oh well, let me go and have a look at the door. Bobby, it's closed. What are you going to do now? We got oh, we'll have to use that then. Maybe it'll break. Oh well, okay. So, uh, well, that was good. Why is there two cars here then? It says closed on the door though. Okay, I'll follow you where we're going to Timmy's first. Yeah. Then I'll follow you where we go to the river. What? Okay. What do you think then, Bobby? So what are you going to catch? Pickerel. Pickerel? Oh, yeah. You're not going to eat it out of this dirty old Thames though, are you? Maybe. No, you won't do that. <laughs> I know what you're like, you always put them back. I know you do. Yeah, that's where we are. So what, what part of the Thames is this? Uh, it's Delaware. 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 Down by the bridge. The Delaware. So uh, we'll see, eh? We'll see if you catch anything. I'll come over and get a bit nearer in a sec. So what are you using then, Bobby? Yum's jig. A yum's jig? All salted and ready to go. What rod you got there? Uh, I actually just bought it not that long ago. Yeah. It's a... Uh, St. Croix. It's a sports edition. It's seven foot. It's a... Um, Fast action, it's one of the lighter rods, you know. I got a little itty bitty Shimano. Shimano reel with it. Nice little one. Show that. Like 180 bucks right. for the set. Show me that jig you got on there. So that's the one, is it? Yep. And you got a lot of faith in that, have you? Oh yeah. You sure? Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's oh, yeah. uh it's my jig. let's see. It's my jig it's okay. Right. We'll see. I, I, it's very hard to film fishing, unless you're very lucky, you know yeah, that. But yeah. like when I fished you fly fishing that day and you <laughs> did first cast and caught one, but I mean, we'll have to see how we go, yeah. all right? Nice cast. You caught anything yet, Bobby? No. No, not yet. Okay. Let's have a look around here, eh? Bobby said, look up there, look. Looks like a lot of people got all their tackle caught up in all them hydro wires up there. Lots of them. There's a big tree. That's uprooted and ended up in the middle of the river. But the old fish like getting around in there for the bugs and things. Hmm. Oh well. You caught anything, Bobby? No. <laughs> okay. Well, we'll, we'll, we'll watch one more cast here. It might be the lucky one. They usually like to take them right on the drop, don't they? Oh, yeah. Usually down here, though, you get them on right off the bank. Yeah. Yeah, they usually hug yeah. the bank. Okay, we'll come back to this in a minute. So, you got one on, Bob? Yep. Oh, I don't believe it. You're too good. What do you think it is? Uh, it's a pickerel. You got a pickerel. pickerel? No way. We've been here probably, well, I just drank my Tim's and I got my first cigarette on the go. Look at that. And he's got one. Unbelievable. Unfreaking believable. What's that like? Let's have a look. Look at that, eh? Tim's River Pip. Hens River Pickerel. That's nice. Not a healthy isn't it? looking one, but. Well, yeah, he's a bit beat up, isn't he? Yeah. But he's there. See the teeth? Oh, yeah, look at him. Wow. 
See, I wouldn't like to eat that. It looks nasty. <laughs> well, there's one bobby. Changed up to a spinner. Ah, that's how you did it. You sneak the spinner on there. Hey, that's the ones I was catching all them bass with last year. Yeah. One just like that. Oh, yeah. Frick, they go nuts for them. Okay, see what else you can do them. Don't get him stuck in your lip, Bobby. <laughs> <laughs> now, these are them ones that we bought at that fishing tackle shop, weren't it? At, yeah. uh, what? Le, Bo Le, Le Bar Barons. Le Barons. They're cool, aren't they? Mm -hmm. It's all the only size I'll use. They're cool. Really cool. So Just get them in the current. See the rod tip? Yeah. It's bouncing. Just work them in the current. Might be a bit cold, Bobby, you know that. Oh, yeah. You said it was going to warm up and you lied to me. <laughs> it's still freaking minus one, yeah? <laughs> what are we doing? Standing by a river, minus one. We've got to be crazy. Oh, yeah. So I brought my gloves. Yeah. It's definitely a nice looking little jig, though, that one. We'll have to get some of those and try them up at uh, Ronda Bay when we take the boat up. We do that this summer. Caught a lot of bass on them. Yeah. A lot of bass, a lot of plate, a lot of pickerel. A lot of rainbows. Yeah. A lot. But like you said, they get chewed up pretty quick, don't they? So uh, you have to have a few spares. Yeah. Well, this one was bought. This one was bought not that long ago. Like. Yeah. They don't last like. Yeah, they were chewed. Yeah. It's probably two months old. Yeah. So you got to keep the new ones going. What? You come prepared. Yeah, you've got a few. You can try anything else. We'll have a few more goes with that one. By far the best color. That Skunky. One. Yeah. By far the best. Yeah. Right, well, you got to catch another fish. You can't only get one. In fact, I could call that luck. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. You got to get another one. Then it ain't luck. Well, Bobby's given up for the minute. As he's rod and tackle, he's uh, he's freaking freezing. He's going, so he's going to get his gloves. I don't know he's going to fish in gloves. I don't know. That'd be a first. Oh well. So I was just saying, Bobby, how the hell are you going to fish in gloves? I see now. Look at that. Everybody's always asking me why I cut the fingers off my gloves. Well, there's the reason why right there. Wow. There you go, tubes. Make a cast. So that finger just gets cold. Yeah. Okay, let's get back out of her then. You gotta get another one, Bob. Oh, yeah. Bobby's got another one. Well, there you go. It wasn't luck then, was it? <laughs> what do you think you got? Looks a bit bigger. Yeah, it feels a little bit bigger. Yeah, a little bigger. Oh yeah. Ah. 
That looks a better one. Quite a nice size. Oh, that's a nice looking one, yeah. It's about two pounds. Yeah. A bit wormy, ain't they? Uh, not too bad. Pretty much fresh in on the lake. Yeah. Wow. We haven't been here that long. We've only been here probably what? Twenty minutes. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Nice one, Bobby. So that's not luck, definitely not luck, because no. that's two fish out of this cold Thames. Yeah. Minus one. Your hand's cold now. Oh yeah. You gonna go for number three? I hope so. Okay, we'll see. So we're all done then, Bobby, eh? Oh yeah. Too cold, isn't it? Too cold. I think I think like like your dad said, didn't he, that there wasn't any pickerel in here, right? <laughs> now I think that he was nearly right. I think there were two only. And uh, I think you caught both of them, bud. I think so. I think that's what he did. So anyhow, great time, Bobby. Oh yeah. And we'll have to do this again, eh? Oh yeah. Right, let's see if we can get in a warm. <laughs>